agreements amongst countries, particularly those on the uh, continent, not uh, being agreed to at the stage reportedly. But uh, perhaps the one uh, CEO that is uh, looking at what is happening in the oil price right now is the CEO of the Cal Group, uh, which uh, reported a, its results, its annual results earlier on today. And we have seen investors plowing into the stock. That stock up uh, almost 6% on the JSC today following the release of those numbers. Uh, Cal, as you would know, uh, was once Carp Agri, uh, but it reported a 42.7% uh, surge in its revenue, boosted by the acquisition of the fuel retailer PEG uh, Retail. Uh, the company saying that recurring headline earnings per share increased by a slow pace, however, of 7.2% uh, to uh, 619.69 cents uh, per share as uh, load shedding costs uh, took some shine uh, off the bottom line. Uh, Sean Welch, CEO at uh, Carl Group, uh, joins the uh, show for more. Sean, thanks so much for your time. Just, um, I mean, just following that uh, recent acquisition of uh, the, uh, the PG and uh, the uh, headlines that circle around the OPEX Plus members and the decision or the stance that they uh, may take towards uh, oil uh, supply cuts, deepening them, extending them. Uh, is this something that you monitor uh, quite closely uh, now, just given the uh, number of uh, fuel retail stores that uh, you run across the country? Absolutely, Pippi. Thank you. Nice to see you again. Um, so uh, we do over 600 million liters of uh, retail fuel a year. Uh, so it's very important for us what uh, the dollar uh, price of the Brent is doing. Um, so every move uh, of a few dollars makes an impact in the South African calculation of the price that gets changed on a monthly basis. So we're expecting a bit of a decrease in diesel, in fact quite a, quite a dramatic decrease of over two rand in the beginning of December, which would be great for a bumper year in, in December. 